Good afternoon. This is Universal News Media. Today is May 7, 2018. Today we will be viewing some highlights from March and also some viewer submitted photos. Thank you everyone who sent photos in. A quick word about the asteroid we've been tracking for several weeks. The area that is viewed by the only weather cam capable of seeing the asteroid has been under very heavy chemtrail since April 19th, without exception. I just checked today and it has scattered clouds, which may or may not allow me to see the asteroid. I won't know for a few hours because of the time difference in Alaska, but I'll keep checking. Our first video is from the south facing weather cam in Onvik, Alaska. In the top left corner, is that striped planet that we've seen so often. And here is the same striped planet from the southeast facing weather cam in Shavak, Alaska. It's very difficult to see the huge red planet in this frame from the southwest facing camera in Marshall, Alaska. It activated the eclipse concealing equipment, which are the odd shaped reflections that you see. We know this is not a lens flare because it is rotating and also because it is moving in the opposite direction of the sun. It's not moving with the sun as a lens flare would. As the sun is moving downward to the right, this planet is rotating and moving upward to the left. We found out something new about this striped, fast rotating planet often seen on the northwest facing weather cam in Tok, Alaska. The red planet that shows up at the same time is obviously moving. We can see that clearly. However, the striped planet doesn't move. It never moves. If we look really close at one particular frame of this striped planet, we see that the orb has a double edge. Just like all the other close-up sky lens photos we've been seeing on Mr. MBB333, WSO, Planet X News, and other channels showing sky anomalies. The function of some of these lenses is to track the incoming system. And this image is being reflected on one of those sky lenses tracking the striped planet. So we are seeing the striped planet, but it's a reflection of the striped planet on one of those sky lenses. The rest of today's photos are from the viewers who sent them in. Thanks to all of you who sent pictures to share. Keep them coming. Sit back and enjoy the rest of the show.